Ah, we are just getting a bag. This is Andre, our violin player, guitar player, and fortunately also drum player. I am Svans, banjo, guitar, singer, lead singer, uh, uh, harmonica, and uh, my name is Cardanelli, uh, accordion and uh, backpack drums and guitar, guitar and okay. second vocal. Yeah. This festival introduced our last works that the album is we've been through the name and uh, after 15 years of, of music together in a different moment yeah. of our life but now it's a lot of here that we play together. together. I think everyone have a different influence music. I'm very influenced by classical music and jazz music. I am more really, into yeah. folk music. They are more uh, folk and he especially. They have um, different influences from um, every type of music, every every style of music, uh, from classical to more, more popular, to to alternative, to avant-garde. Yes, our music is very heterogenic. Uh, sound have a different kind of a we start with the river song guitar and, and, and voice passing through the french music to the tex mex, tex -Mex uh, Balkan, and uh, volcanic uh, um, influence jewish electronic uh, yeah. industrial we are ecliptical uh, but uh, i hope with a style a single style inside uh, like a like a bag the same bag with different object inside. <laughs> yeah. The and cat. A cat and a cat. That the I cat know. in the bag is something you try to uh, hide, carry on, and, and carry on uh, at the same time. It's, it's just it's a, like a, cr a cross. It's like a ghost. It's like a remorse. It's actually taken from uh, Mark Twain, Tom Sawyer. It's uh, voodoo and uh, blues imagery in it. And Schrodinger too. <laughs> you can't shred. <laughs> but I, I have a cat and I loved her yeah. so uh, much. All the, all the lyrics and uh, the main, uh, the main uh, aesthetic uh, portion of the work came from uh, Svans. Once I, I used to write both uh, lyrics and music, but uh, in the first album. Yeah. Then uh, uh, I can say now we sound more like a band, a proper band, because uh, we are connected and uh, in, the, in every part of the process of, of uh, making a song. So it's not only I wrote the song, you now have to play it. Now we compose together and uh, we take part in the, all the, the arrangements. And uh, yes. on stage this is good because we have our connection to every single song. And this is a, another way to play. It's not only my, my own depression spread up to the world, but also a great part of it is. <laughs> we met uh, uh, five years ago uh, with the third album, Sad Dolls and Furious Flower. Yeah. Uh, and we. We meet with a uh, Janusz, uh, uh, very instinctively, was very good. Uh, he is a great person. He, he worked uh, with uh, Hugo Reis, yeah, a, uh, friend. a friend of ours, uh, and, yes. uh, and uh, his, um, his catalog is filled up with uh, music uh, so close to her, uh, the one we make. And um, basically, for us, it was 
quite important to go out from our country. So Poland was a good point. And, and Gustav uh, especially was perfect size for us and uh, we, can, uh, we can be free to, to do what, what we do without any mainstream uh, yeah, uh, background uh, yeah, or, or uh, spectative <laughs> maybe yeah. and uh, yeah. we can we can make everything we want yeah we can change kind of music every time and uh, this, this is quite good because in our country is not like that no you are uh, part of a catalog and uh, you are a uh, part of a label and part of a um, market. It's probably more strange is and more uh, Gustav Recker <laughs> could be interested about it. And uh, this is good things for in indie music and uh, folk Yes, this music. is real independent Re yeah, independent it's music. It's real. This is a real independent festival. This is what we used to call independent long ago, but in Italy now, indie, it's a word for uh, pop music uh, played um, wrong. Come si diceva in polacco? Jim Kuje. Jim Kuje, me? Jim Kuje.